everyone, um, this is Angel Holt with Angel Holt Designs, and um, I wanted to share with y'all my next project. I am making a um, mini album wardrobe slash armoire, and I have built my basic box, as you can see here, and I'm going to give you the dimensions of the box, um, and then, I mean, you build a box first, and you pick out, you know, the size that you want. So the size I decided to go with um, to match my hangers that are going to hang, these hangers I purchased and leaks to the hardware and everything I use on being my group. So be sure to be subscribed to all of my social media so you know when I drop my group link so that you can be a part of it. These are about three and three fourths wide um, hangers. So I had to definitely make sure that I put the wooden dial in there, you know. I don't know if I can tell right there. See, it'll fit perfectly and everything. So the hangers can possibly hold a front and back uh, mini page to hold photos, um, little mementos and everything so all of that will be recorded and I will go live working on it um, I still have to make the doors and I am looking into putting a drawer down here you know from here down um, still in the works for that but at the top here um, I've created me a pattern and but first before I show you the sides of the box are six inches by ten inches the back is seven and a half by ten and the top and the bottom pieces are six inches by seven and a half so I double sure yep six by seven and a half on the money okay so now on the top I made a mitered 22.5 degree angle okay and what my plan is is I'm going to create a perfect minor and then they're going to slant can you see how it's going to slant inward on all four sides and of course it'll have a top but it's going to slant like this and that's going to give it a lot of decorative dimension at the top. I'm going to be working on that. And um, definitely the doors. Um, I've ordered hardware. And any of the hardware that I use will be over linked in my group on Facebook. Again, be sure to be subscribed to all of my social media so you know when the link will drop. I normally put it on Facebook, my personal page, and then my business page. That's where you would find the link. Um, so, but that's the process and the paper collection I'm using, um, this is not sponsored, um, it's called the Ar Arquella Dreams, Arquell Dreams, I don't know if I'm chopping that up or not, but that's the paper collection I'm using, uh, both for the, the box and for all of the pages on the inside. Um, again, like I said, I ordered hardware, I ordered feet, a closure with a lock. I have a unique design concept for the lock. Can't wait to show y'all. So, um, I think this is going to be one of my top projects that I've made. I'm really excited about it. And when I get excited about a project, it just flows and becomes what I want it to be. So, I hope that y'all continue to be on the journey with me for this project, and uh, I'll see you in the upcoming videos. Bye.